got 15 on each leg. Today is a two by 15 again, but we're gonna do it a little different than we did yesterday. So you get a nice taste of the different and in. So you're squeezing from the top of your butt. That's where that press is coming from. Think about trying to lift the ceiling up. You're keeping your body in a nice square position. So your head is in line with the side of the butt and sort of that bottom part where your hamstring meets your booty on the outside of your leg. The part that tends to droop, ladies, that we hate when we put on a bathing suit. Yeah, that's what you're lifting. Holy moly. We feel it. Is anybody else's legs shaking? There's a minor bend in your knees. Your hips are shooting back. And then your hips are the first thing to pull up under you. That's what lifts you back up. Core is tight. Back is flat when I go forward. And my right shoulder is engaged. So Ryan, do me a favor, come in front and lift. Now, when you sink back, I need you to lay your stomach completely flat and keep your abs engaged. So shift those hips back. Keep that left leg straight. And you can put a little to my bottom leg so I have this counterbalance push-pull happening so that I can get even more of a contraction on this hamstring. You can put the top hand on the ground to help you stabilize, keep the core tight, weight back into your heels. Now, I have my weight at my sides. Jazz has hers at her chest. That's okay. It's just a comfort level, whatever feels good so it's not pulling on your lower